Most people approach bank shots as geometric in nature. That is, they look at the angle and they try to figure out the fixed location on the rail that they need to aim. And then if the balls aren't lined up quite right, they'll attempt to cut the ball into that location. But of course, cutting the ball introduces a whole host of factors that make the shot much more complex. I believe you can make a much higher percentage of bank shots if you isolate your aiming inputs into just one factor, speed. Of course, this recognizes that bank shots are not simply geometric. There's a lot of physics involved, right? The way the balls collide, the inertia of the ball, the impact with the rail, the spin of the ball, all these things go into how the ball is going to rebound off the rail. Aim with speed is an extensive collection of virtually every useful bank shot pattern. All patterns are calculated using medium speed and a center ball hit. This neutral stroke ensures the purest rail action and the flexibility to make adjustments later by varying power in English. All patterns are sighted from diamond to diamond rather than from rail groove to rail groove. This results in a straight line of aim rather than a confusing zigzag. All patterns are broken down into incremental adjustments from a primary starting point. This memory technique enables the recreation of entire bank shot patterns on the fly. All patterns use a consistent naming strategy to uniquely classify each shot because there's a whole world of bank shots beyond cross side and cross corner. In the absence of anything better, I've created a formula to systematically name them. All patterns align with the typical vanishing point for each shot. While every table plays differently due to varying dimensions and conditions, these numbers should only need minor adjustment, if any, to work on the majority of pool tables. As an added bonus, if you master the full hit bank shot, you're going to be able to better calibrate your line of aim when the balls are aligned too far for a full hit and you're forced to cut the ball. Although the library is organized by the number of rails for each shot, I actually think of them separately by their usefulness in live play, because that's not the same thing. I actually think of four categories. You have a bunch of essential shots, you have useful shots, you have occasional shots, and then you have exhibition shots. When you're finally ready to bear down and actually memorize some of these patterns, I'd recommend starting with the essential category and take it slow. You can't master these things overnight. Even the best systems are only going to get you 90% of the way there. The final 10% required to make these shots with precision and consistency is only developed through a feel of the table over years of practice and repetition. But I truly believe the aim with speed system and the concept of a full hit bank shot is going to change the way you look at a pool table.